this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add your own CAD model to the model library. We have a robot with an end of arm tool already attached with its TCP already created and our tool data already defined. So let's start with opening the CAD tree, expand the robot model until you see the end of arm tool. Or we'll right click on the end of arm tool and select add model library. In this window, many options can be configured. So let's set this up as a tool and not a workpiece. We'll use the flange and not the location of the TCP. Select Get Tool Data if you need to change the active tool data from another set in the controller. Set your category and set the name. And when you're ready, select OK. Now select Model Library, and as you can see, your tool has been added, but there's no preview picture. To add an image, simply go into the CAD tree, hide the robot model and floor, and zoom in on the end of arm tool. Use Windows Snipping Tool to screen capture this image and paste that into Microsoft Paint. Now simply save this image as a bitmap in the location of your new model folder. Call it item.bitmap. Hit save and now you should be able to see this in the model library. To test the model just drag it over any section of the robot. It should attach the flange, adjust the TCP, and add the tool data automatically. And you're done.